Hello, welcome back student. Today we are going to see the next topic in unit 1 that is regular expression, okay, regular expression, okay. So what is this regular expression? Uh, when we will say the any expression is a regular expression. So here, so the regular ex expression can recursively define as follows. Whenever it is happen, this rules, then only we can say this is a regular expression, okay. This is epsilon is a regular expression indicate the language contain any empty screen. So, L is epsilon is nothing but we are getting the here L L epsilon is equals to epsilon. Whenever the epsilon is there, then if any empty string, okay, then it will be is a epsilon. So, if it is any empty language, then that is a regular expression. Another one is phi, okay, phi is a regular expression denoting an empty string, denoting as a empty string. You can define empty string for the phi or you can define for the lambda, okay. Any one of this you can define for the empty string. Next, x is a regular expression when L is equals to x, okay. L is equals to x. What is x? x is a string, okay. x is a string. Next, fourth point, if x is a regular expression denoting the language L x and y is a regular expression denoting language L y, then, then x plus y is regular expression considering to the language. So, what is this plus? Plus is nothing but union, we will say union L of x union L of y, where L of x plus y is equals to L of x union L of y, okay. Whenever we have the expression like this, you can do the union, okay. Next, next one is concatenation. This is x point y is a regular expression consideration uh, corresponding to the language L x dot L y, where L x, where L of x and y is equals to L x dot L y. So, what is this dot? This is concatenation, okay. This is concatenation. Next is R, R star. What is this R star? R star, I hope you remember the uh, closure, closure star, closure star as well as we studied about plus, okay. Already we have seen closure star as well as plus, okay, closure plus. So, R star is a regular expression considering to the language if L of R star, okay, where L of, L of R star is equals to L of R whole star, okay. So, this is a regular expression. Whenever this rules is applied, then only this is regular expression. If you did not understand, do not worry. When I take the example, then you can easily understand the things, okay. First point, first point, okay. What is first point? Regular expression means what is the x like a, b, c, d. This all are, this all are regular expression, okay. This 
and you can add the this uh, phi okay and you can add the lambda empty string okay this is all our symbols and this is regular expression this is regular expression okay like regular expression where l is equals to x so this is like this okay next second one second one regular expression one like this is consider this is regular one expression and we have regular expression two this one okay when we have the regular expression one as well as two so you can do the as it is telling union r1 union r2 okay i am writing the same thing like this l of x union l of y so l of x is regular expression one l of y is another expression so r1 union r2 or in place of this you can write plus in this of union you can write plus plus is also represent as union okay next next we will see this x concatenation r1 and r2 there is a two regular expression and here we need to write r1 dot dot is nothing but con concatenation r2 okay this is concatenation and this is union i am whatever it is returning here that i am directly showing you here without any sentence if both two expressions are there so that you can change to r regular one expression dot regular ex expression two okay in the same way r1 and if r1 is r star okay r star star is as i told you this is a closure star and what it will do in closure is star it will include the empty string also okay if you have like this so take the example once again i will repeat you once again i will repeat you here if example if we have this is r star so in language string if we have the x x star okay if we have the x star then it will be include the empty string comma x comma x x comma x x x so on okay so on this is called iteration or closure okay this is also come under in regular expression clear so in place of this x x is a string i am taking you can take any string a b c any string then that will be include the lambda okay include the lambda that is empty string in the r star okay so this is a thing now so this is a simple thing now i will take some of the examples okay i will take some of the examples now i am taking like uh, first i will take 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 
here R union R2. So, this is a main important thing when we have to take the union, when we have to take the concatenation. Sorry. So, when we have to take the union, that is when you do not have a empty, empty string, any lambda or epsilon, okay. That time you need to take union 0, union 1, union 2, union 3. This is your regular expression, okay. Next. Here, next one I am taking uh, empty string, like uh, you can say uh, epsilon, you can take epsilon here. epsilon comma, epsilon comma, if you have some number like uh, A, B, C, if you have something like that. So, this is, this also a regular expression. Now, we need to take the concatenation because, because we have the epsilon, okay, or you can say lambda, epsilon comma, sorry, it should not be right comma here, epsilon a, b, c, directly you can write or you can write full stop, okay. You can put the dot or you can directly write e, a, b, c. So, this is also a one type of regular expression. Next, in the next if we take example like b, b, a, a, and B and uh, A, A, B example. This is my expression, okay. In this expression, should I need to take epsilon means uh, should I take concatenation or union? What should I do with this? So, here we do not have epsilon empty string. So, that means we have to make it plus we have to make it plus. So, R is equals to what is B B A plus A plus union B union A A B. So, this is your answer. When you need to take, when we need to do union, when you have to take concatenation, you must know about that, okay. Whenever we have a empty string or epsilon, okay, then time we need to use concatenation. Okay, now next one is like take epsilon, comma, uh, take a, comma, a, a, comma, a, 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 comma, so on. What is this? Can you see here x, 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 here the lambda, okay, this is lambda only, and lambda or uh, that is empty string, okay. You will go with the lambda, otherwise you will get confused. Okay, lambda comma x comma x, x comma x, x comma. So, here delta a comma a a comma a a a comma a a a a so on. So, in place of this you can write r is equals to when this is closure star r or is equals to a power star this is a answer okay. So, here whenever we get this you need to write r star. Next, next uh, I will go with 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, comma, so on. Here, what you need to write here? What you need to write here? Here, when you write the star, that time the empty string or uh, null 
starting 0 will be added here ok, but here you need to take 1 plus why 1 plus 1 is a string and plus is a keen I hope you remember keen plus keen plus and keen sorry keen star in this star it will add the epsilon ok and here in the sorry in the plus keen plus it will not include the lambda lambda remember the lambda ok lambda will not add in the keen plus ok and uh, in keen star lambda will be added already we have done in this uh, second lecture ok you can go and see in detail about keen star and keen plus ok so this is a simple for the regular expression ok in the next class we will see the regular expression identities ok thank you